Good morning. Happy Sunday. I think the incense is bothering my throat a little bit today. Um, it is July 21st. I am the News River Witch and I'm going to do a single card pull for you today. Grab your tea. Remember, a good herbal tea is a great way to start your day. Focus on your holistic um, well-being. Glass of water. Do those things every day. All right. So I'm going to pull the card from the River Witch Oracle. Um, this card comes from the deck that I created. Um, it is available on my website at nooseriverwitch.com. And um, everything on my site is on sale this month. And this is for the release of my deck. Um, everything's 30% off right now, including my custom decks, my classes, um, and even my jewelry and so forth. It's, everything's on sale. No code needed. Just log in and buy. Um, okay, we're going to pull our card. All right, our card for today is the Fire Talker. The key words for this card are healing, wisdom, and transformation. So the Fire Talker is inspired by a story that my grandmother told me uh, about an aunt of mine who touched the stove as an aunt. She was a small child, toddler. She touched the cast iron stove in the house and burnt her hands very severely. So my grandmother scooped her up and took her to the local healer, um, who was a black woman who was a fire talker. She was able to talk the fire out of my aunt's hands. And that was just using a direct quote from my grandmother. She talked the fire out of her hands. Um, I found this very interesting, obviously, um, and uh, started doing research. And I found that it's very common. It's a common uh, story in African culture, um, the Gullah people. Um, you know, root work and hoodoo all have something similar um, where a person speaks to the damaged part, if you will, talks to the fire and talks it out of them. So that was the inspiration for this card. Our first word for this card is healing. Right now we are in the middle of the buck moon. Um, it just, I believe we're in the middle, it just started this morning. Um, I, my Weather is awful, so I don't get to see it today, uh, but the buck moon is here. Full moon is a great time for healing, so you want to channel that healing energy along with the powers and the, the uh, energy of this card. Um, the other word or another word on this card is transformation. So just like the image shows, it's like someone rising from the ashes or rising up through the fire. Transform yourself today. Find a way to grow and learn. Pick up something new. Um, I'm doing a... a research right now for a, a presentation that um, we're going to have at Kevin and Hecate monthly meeting related to nonviolent communication. So I've been working on, you know, getting some imagery and some things like that around to help transform my language and to make sure that I'm working in the way that I want to work. So find a way to grow, find a way to learn. Um, and then our other word for the card is wisdom. Um, I mentioned Covenant Hecate. Many of the, the folks watching this right now may be members. You may want to be a member of Covenant Hecate. Um, if you do, certainly go and look at HecateBremo.org, um, and that is Hecate with a C, um, and you can uh, read about how to become a member. But part of our membership is uh, following the five virtues, and wisdom is one of the five virtues of Hecate, and we, try, we strive to bring that into our lives every day. So this card calls on that energy and says, you know, look inside. What is wisdom? How do you bring it? How do you look at it? Reach out to the ancestors. Reach out to your grandma, you know, someone who's still alive, an auntie, someone that you relate to, and pull that wisdom into your day. Um, I hope that was helpful for you today. Uh, if you have questions or comments, you know, I love getting them in the messages. Please keep sending them over. Uh, but just keep in mind, if you have something that someone else may grow from or learn from, put it in a comment, right? We want to engage with others. We want them to learn and to grow. Um, so if you have those questions, keep them coming. Uh, I love to hear from you. Um, I'm trying to build my channel, so remember to subscribe. Um, if you have the, uh, if you have an account, if you don't, if you want to create one, hey, you know, it's not like I'm going to bug your inbox. Um, so yeah, I, I hope that this has been helpful for you today and uh, I look forward to talking to you soon. Have a glorious Sunday.